comes for years with my soul. Quit. Come on, Jesus. And I hear that song the old folks used to sing. He's sweet, I know. He is sweet. I know. I don't know what you know, but I know. They had their own testimony. I got mine, you got yours. But he is sweet. I know. Glory be to God. So as we come today, and I greet all of you, men, women, in your rightful places, to my husband, I love you. God bless you. Long time. Long time. And we still loving on each other. Nobody but me. To the choir, I love you. God bless you. All of you that came, every church, Every pastor, every apostle, every prophet, amen, every evangelist, every preacher, every pastor. God bless you. Could have been anywhere else today. But God chose you to be here. I heard you, apostle. Definitely, this is an assignment. This scripture that was read in your hearing earlier was right on time. Took me a little deeper. Second Corinthians chapter four. If you were standing on your blessed feet, because we are serving that awesome God. I don't care who you are and how you got up in here. If you won't roll up in here, you got strength to stand up. Because this is God's word, and it says. But we have, starting at 2 Corinthians chapter 4, uh, verse number 7. But we have this treasure in earthly vessels that the intimacy of the power may be of God and not of us. I could have stopped right there. But, but, but there's another side to this. But we are troubled on every side, yet not distressed. We are perplexed, but not in despair. Persecuted, but not forsaken. Cast down, but not destroyed. Always bearing in the body. The dying of the Lord Jesus. That the life also of Jesus might be manifested in our body. The word of God for the people of God. Let us pray. Eternal our wise Father, we come now in the mighty name of Jesus. For there is no other help we know. Yes, Lord. If thou would draw thyself from us, Father, where would we go? Where would we, go we have nowhere to go, God. You are the rock of salvation. Yes, yes, the bishop of our soul. Yes, the bright and morning yes, star. Yes, the living of the valley. Our everlasting to yes, everlasting. Lord. Thou art God. You are our yes, way maker. Jehovah's Shalom, our Jehovah's Shalom. Uh, You're everything to us. So I ask you now in the name of Jesus to allow me to sit down and allow your Holy Spirit to come forth. For your glory, nothing of my own, I'm just a bit of the rag. But for your glory, for it's in the name of Jesus Christ, I do pray. Amen. Amen. You may be seated in the presence of the Almighty God. The verse I want to preach from today is verse number 10. Always bearing about in the body the dying of the Lord Jesus. That the life also 
towards Jesus might be manifested in our bodies. If I was used for a topic today, it would be a charge to keep. If I was to use a subtopic, higher heights and deeper depths to condemn, do us wrong. Higher heights and deeper depths until death was part. You know, when I think about who was writing, amen, this writ, amen, it was Paul who had been through so much. I don't really think that we as Christians really understand the magnitude of how much we go through. So God put Paul, amen, in our midst. He had a plan. Amen. Uh, somebody that's going to preach the word of God and teach the word of God and won't go add nothing to it and won't go take nothing from it. Uh, somebody that was sold out for God. I don't care who you look for in the word of God. You won't find nobody except Jesus most sold out with Paul. Paul was one of those that was a bad man. Uh -huh. Amen. He was in the world. Can I just talk for a few minutes? He was in the world. Nobody didn't scare Paul. He took what he wanted to take. He ministered to who he wanted to minister to. He lied and he got everybody that he wanted so he could get recognition, amen, on his journey. But one day on that road to Damascus, amen, I got into Damascus, what was here? Let me call up the road. If there ain't no homemongers in here, if there ain't no liars in here, if there ain't no truths, if there ain't no fighters in here, Paul. Paul said, look at here. Let me give you some of my rest. 
resume. You know, they go on a job. You have to have a resume. But I'm so glad we don't have to have nothing but ourselves. When we come to God Almighty, He said, when you come, you better come to it. Paul said, look at him. I had an experience. Can I just tell you about myself? He said, I had an experience. I'm on the road to Damascus. I was going to see who else I could get taken to jail. Y'all don't hear me now. He said, but then I didn't understand that it was my last time. I was going to take another direction. Can I get anybody here? I can't stop talking. I can't stop 
Watch this now. Acts chapter 26. Amen. Paul, amen, had already told them, amen, that he had to go. Amen. And he went, amen, to a river where the man came. Bernice was there with him. He spoke the gospel. Now, why you say this? I'm going to take you to the word. He said in chapter 26, in verse 15, he said, we had, amen, this condition, amen, of killing him and putting people in jail. And he began to tell the Agrippa and all those that were with him, praise God, hallelujah. He said that he heard somebody speaking to him, he heard a voice speaking unto me, speaking in the Hebrew tongue, so, so, why persecuted thou me? It's hard for thee to kick against the freak. And I said, Who art thou, Lord? That he ministered in to Agrippa and the whole church system. And he said, And the Lord said, I am Jesus, whom thou persecuted. But rise and stand upon thy feet, for I have appeared unto thee. For this purpose, to make thee a minister. Look here what he said. Come on, somebody. And not only that, and a witness for both of these things. Hallelujah, thee. Deliver thee from the people and from the Gentiles. Of whom now I see thee. I'm getting ready to send you to some wicked people. I know you tried. To tell them here's the lights. Some listen and don't some then listen. But Paul, I'm getting ready to open up a door for you. All you gotta do is just step in. Come on, somebody. I want you to go over there and never say witness to all those ones that didn't get a chance the first time. Somebody say, Yes, Lord. To whom now? To open their eyes, the eyes are closed. They got scales on the wall, just like you have. And to turn them from darkness into light, and from the power of the Satan unto God. Satan got a grip on them. Come on, somebody. I see my head. You them grip flies. When they grip flies, grab hold of something. It's going to be hard. Thank you. 
can't do this. Uh, you got to die in that spirit. Uh, you do what you want in God. Therefore, therefore, I was not obedient unto the heavenly vision which showed first of the day to make the masses and Jerusalem and through all out the posts of Judea and then to the Gentiles uh, that they should repent uh, and turn from God uh, and do the work uh, before repenting us. Look at here, we gotta tell everybody. Uh, Care what you done. Come on, somebody. What you were just right for God to use you. Come on, somebody. You ain't the only one that got seen in your life. Come on, somebody. You ain't the only one that been cast down. You're not the only one that been in despair. You're not the only one that had a broken heart. Let you know that when the word comes in, uh, stuff get ready to change. Uh, but Jesus Christ, uh, the righteous one, uh, came me uh, and set me free. And now that I'm free, uh, I'm free indeed. I don't have no more chains uh, holding me. Uh, go ahead, come on me. Uh, go ahead, come on me. Uh, go ahead. Come on, somebody. Come on, Silas. Let us get a song. He ain't one in here don't know nothing about it. But let us get a song in our spirit. Wow. He's gonna show his ugly. 
that's a shoe every you and I want. But you better know how to knock that deal. That's right. I said, uh-huh, yeah. Because I promise God that I will serve you until I die. Amen. 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 You see, I didn't just know it. I will make sure just to be doing something. Yeah. He told me uh, that you're going to take me to higher heights uh, and deeper deeper. Uh, and he told me, uh, and I promise him uh, to do us part. Uh, whether he's saving God, like he has to be, some to be saved. Yeah, they will never fall. So what you say is going to fall. Okay. Death is going to stay on something. Yes. It's a point of man once. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 But oh my God, uh, I really A gripper 
said unto Mark, Lord, have mercy. Almost. Almost. Now we could preach on that almost right there. That's right. Almost is a long way for 100%. Yeah. Yes, it is. Almost is a long way for you making up your mind to do like Michelle, Jesus Christ. Keep on preaching the word. Almost thou persuaded me to be a Christian. Verse 29 of Acts 26. And Paul said, I wish to God that not only did you, but also all that he'll be this day were both almost and all together such as I am except these women. Paul said, look here. I see you got chains on. Uh, but y'all free me. You can praise God anytime you get me. I can praise him too, but, but look, I'm kind of, y'all think I'm living because I got these handcuffs on me. You think I'm living because I got these afflictions on me. Come on, somebody. But I tell you today, ain't no limits on God. What's impossible, man? It's possible with God. He'll make another one that looks just like Sing loud. Pray hard. Come on, somebody. Shout to the glory of God. Come on, easy with y'all. Better stop playing with God. Pick up. One thing I found out about Paul Paul is real to the book. He got some that's real now. Come on, somebody. Don't you fret yourself. The thing you the only one. Come on. Come on, somebody. You're not the only one, nor am I. The prayer of us will come. I got many scriptures to back up what I'm saying. We, as a body of believers, are to forever be growing in Christ. That's right. That's right. Serving in love. Yes. In love and encompass forgiveness. Oh, well, I got to call there for a bit now. Come on. You can save all you want to. Mm -hmm. Save you save. That's right. But if you are not forgiven, uh -huh. those that have mistreated you, yeah. talk about you, abuse you, yeah. and God ain't gonna forgive you. Come on, Sarah. Had all this money owed. Called in to the pay his debt. I'm in the word. And God that called on mercy to suit his case. Mercy stepped in and set it free. A lot of us have been set free. But now you go out and want to beat somebody over the head uh, because they ain't saved like you want me to say. Guess what? You didn't save yourself. Look at that. You and I are not going to get God's glory. Come on, somebody. We are conditioned for a ministry of all seasons. When we look, when we die. With two or three, one or two. Come on, somebody. Hey, glory be to God. See, if you ain't got the two, I look at three. Where two or three again are the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Huh? Everywhere I go, they go with me. And grace is mercy. I got them on each side of me. And I got God in my back. Go forward. Go forward. You can do this. Just because you got that job. Come on. You ain't watch the news lately. Come on. Now, who would have thought banks would be laying on? Yes. Come on, somebody. Yes. Who would have thought all these 
get places be laying off. Who would have thought that the billionaire ain't meant to go lay off all these people? I know what won't lay off. Feel the sun. Come on. Tell you don't eat dead. Come on. Don't eat dead. 
we are perplexed, perplexed and, and not in despair. Uh, you can't take what God done gave me. Uh, persecuted, uh, harassed, and ridiculed uh, on every side. Then go by your church and they wave their hands and say, See? Look how many cars they got out there uh, in the parking lot today. Uh, come on, somebody. I told you, you just keep on watching and the door will be closed. That's why. But God is the one that what? Created the church. He said, upon this one, I will. He knows who the church is. But God, our everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace, our mighty Captain, the ruler of the whole world, He coming back. In a moment, in a tweet, oh night, somebody say, until death do us part, I got a charge to keep. He knows who belongs to him. Do you belong to him today? In the wind, in the middle of the wind. Come on, somebody. He'll pick you up when you wake up. Come on, somebody. He'll turn you quick away and make it clean. We have in Jesus. Listen. He died. Yes, he did. He rose up on the third day after being in a bar of two. He knows he won't be there alone. You can go over there now and you can shake every casket over there, but you ain't gonna find him now. Because he rolls up. And if he rolls up, we can rise up too. Come on, somebody. Hey, it's all people that go high, high, and people tell me. Trouble in my way. I have to cry sometimes. So much trouble. I feel away at night. But that's all right. Because I know the one that rolls up out of the grave. He coming back to get me. Real, real soon. Look at somebody say, stay, stay, stay to me. Stay to me. Jesus is coming back for you and I. Are you in? Come on, stand on your feet. And give God some